the, the idea of you know, a child having to fight a fire, because that's just, because what, what are you gonna do is pretty full on. It's not that's something you'd wish on anyone, you know, especially fire, fire is just as a primal. It's just a primal thing. It's just a, it's a very deep human, you know, fire is one of the key reasons that humans are the way that they are. The way they've been able to, you know, adapt across the ages to all the um, environments that we've been able to kind of, you know, live in. You know, it's, it's what makes us, a lot of us, who we are. From a you know, historical perspective, but you know, it's also something that's like last year seriously schooled us over time. I mean, I've, I felt pretty stressed this year, you know, just as a person during the pandemic, you know, and that's just been, you know, needing to deal with kids sitting on the couch, cooking dinner, you know, doing basic things. It's not dealing with a pandemic and having a house burnt to shreds and, you know, other major insecurities in your life. So, you know, I imagine a lot of these kids are experiencing um, parents who are doing the best with what they've got, but they just don't have much to give. You know, they're just exhausted. You know, so I like the idea of these, the noodle cart creating a, you know, a place, a calm place where they can be, just be themselves, be a child, play and explore and develop their brains and do the things they want to do without all those pressures.